Um, the question, can Saturday Night Live impact voters' opinions and um, behaviors? Yeah, I think it can. Uh, definitely with the the first, maybe with the, the second, uh, with some qualifications. In fact, there's empirical evidence that has come out to, that actually demonstrates that there was a what's called the Fay effect, the Tina Fay effect, and her impact on uh, voters' support or opposition of Sarah Palin in the 2008 presidential election. So, yeah, not only do I think that, uh, evidence shows that that clearly is the case. Saturday Night Live is a very popular program. Um, one of its legacies that is continu continuously talked about, they air specials on it, it's the political segments that they do. So you can go back to the show's beginning and trace it up to today. It's an integral part of the show. So it's popularity, it's history with political uh, subjects, I think, certainly. It, it, it does shape how people think about politics. The, the issue that you have here is does it shape people's ideas about politics or does it just reflect what people are thinking about politics and take advantage of it? It's the whole chicken egg conundrum that we fall into here. I think it can do both. Now we're having fun. <laughs> <laughs> Intentionally, I think the only thing they intentionally do is try to get airtime. Um, I also believe that they go in with their own, I'll use the word loosely, biases, political beliefs, political biases. They look for opportunities, and I think all three of those things, the opportunity, their position on uh, an issue that relates to that opportunity, and their desire to get airtime uh, being the utmost important, uh, I think that, yeah, that leads to that intentionality. Gonna do it, not gonna die. In all my years of government service, I never once said, not gonna die. You know, can they benefit? I think who benefits the most is gonna be the rival challenger of the candidate who's being lampooned on Saturday Night Live. In terms of the, ben the benefit, you know, can a, someone who's being lampooned on Saturday Night Live, can they benefit? Um, in your question, you know, you talked about Sarah Palin showing up to counter Tina Fey's caricature of her. And yeah, I think how they handle it is the big thing. Um, benefit may take it a bit too far, neutralize it, or at least minimize the impact, um, I think would probably be the best case scenario. But benefit may be a bit of a stretch.